let's just start right now. Hey, welcome to the Lazy Koalas podcast, where we oh. are still Hi. getting ready. <laughs> hey, we're almost done this. That's good. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, we got me, Ultrox, uh, what is it, Twisty, Dreadcore, and Cody. Did you just call me an it? Hi. <laughs> this is a highly did. rushed uh, episode of Dude Soup right now. Hey. <laughs> Yeah. The best. the best. Okay, so... The best around. Basically, uh, we were busy doing a collab with Totally Good at Games yesterday. Didn't get to do a podcast, so we did it earlier today, and I kind of got carried away doing other stuff, so I didn't get to do that. Uh, and also, Joker has to go soon, so that's not good. So we're doing this real quickity split-like. Okay. It's going to be a five-minute oh. podcast. <laughs> like and done. Done. <laughs> done, guys. Okay, uh, let's see. Already finished. So, I think we should talk a little bit about this call that we did. Because I think all of us were there, right? Uh, Drake, all of us who were there I, were I, there. I, yeah. yeah, all of you that were there were there. Mm -hmm. yep. I was working. Oh, yeah. Because I am I am an adult doing adult things. Okay. I have I have to adult lays. Why don't you brag about it some more, Drake? Yeah, man. No, no, no. The, the adulting is not something to brag about. It's okay. It's, it's annoying. It's sad. Something... It's depressing. Yeah. yeah. What have I done? I fucking sleep all day. How about that? <laughs> yeah. How about that for bragging? Mmm. Man. <laughs> Shout out to Ultras for waking up extra early for this <laughs> bad podcast. <laughs> okay. Kinda. I planned <laughs> on it. Yeah. Okay. So. And you slept in your alarm. It was, it was it must have been going off for an hour before I woke up. <laughs> Jesus. I only woke up like 30 minutes ago. <laughs> I did. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Totally good at games. Totally good at games. That was pretty fun. We played Minecraft. Uh, a little bit of everything on Hypixels. Played Minecraft. <laughs> yeah. We uh, played mini games. We played Mirror's Edge. <laughs> I hear that game's exactly like Minecraft. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, uh, pretty good session, I think. Probably gonna be doing more of them later. Uh, yeah. Seem like good dudes. Seem like good dudes. What do you guys like the most out of, like, the games that we did play? I like Quakecraft. Um, yeah, that was actually really nice. I, I haven't played that mode before on that server. That was, I like that. Yeah. The one where you go around and shoot people, besides the fact <laughs> that Twisted and Fall... Oh, <laughs> spoiler. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you know. Twisted was an asshole to me. That's all you need to know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Pope Pool. Man. Like, yeah, Quakecraft Pope Pool didn't have a chance. Fuck that is discrimination. <laughs> Man. It's against the religion. We got like an HR person in here. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap. Not in the world. Anyways, yeah. Uh, man. Also, Cody, you're in here, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, before you leave, let's talk a little bit about the Sky Factory you guys have been doing. Cause like We oh, stopped that a bit ago. We stopped that a while ago. Alright, <laughs> fuck it, who cares? Talk about what you did do whenever you were there. <laughs> um I I left I left during the Stone Age and he woke up uh during the uh the the Bronze Age or something. No, he left during the Stone Age and if he okay. did come back before the world got fucked, he would have come back during the mid industrial age. Well, let's give a little bit more context here, because currently you just said Stone Age, Bronze Age. Nobody knows what that is. Uh, okay. So, yeah. Like, you start out basically like in the... This Wit Civilization Age. Five. I think so. Yeah, that's exactly what this is. Wow. <laughs> you guys been gone to you? Oh. Okay. That's pretty accurate, actually. Yeah. When he left, we didn't have a house. There was only one level. Uh, when I when the world got corrupted, there was two levels, a house, and we had or I had automated all or like iron, aluminum, and metals and stuff. Jeez. Yeah. yeah. I also had a jetpack. Went to the Nether, killed some yeah. blazes. Uh, Jeez, fucking Christ! Yeah. So you guys mm -hmm. really been playing Sky Factory? Yeah, the world no, got corrupted. No. He's been really playing Sky Factory. Oh. I haven't played it in all. I thought Dreadcore and Twisted had been playing it a lot, though. I don't no, know. We've been playing uh, Regrowth. Regrowth. Oh, right, Regrowth. Completely okay. different. Talk about that one. <laughs> um, I can show you a screenshot. <laughs> sure. I'm a farmer in it. 
Well, not a screenshot. Uh, I can show you the live action. Got some live action footage? Live yes. action footage. Yeah, that's gonna screw the cameras. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's gonna screw the cameras a little bit. Uh, okay. Well. You ready? Uh, sure. Okay, we're good. Oh, I see. This is our world so far. Oh, hey. We got a forgery thing over here. Yeah. We got our uh, this. Uh, we got some. Um, some voodoo shit that Drake Horse fucking with. I don't know what that is. Okay. I got my house, oh, the house of heads. That's house not heads. the voodoo shit. That's okay. not this. This is magic, nature magic. The voodoo shit's over oh. here. Oh, you started witchery? Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah, he uh, he got a voodoo doll and started messing with me earlier. That was funny. Hmm. This is the voodoo shit. In the world is that? I see a bunch of stuff I never seen before in my life. <laughs> Look, we have our, our chicken our chicken holocaust over here. What in the world is going on over there? Are those About chickens caged chicken. for the eggs? Yes. Wow. Yes. But they're in cages. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Yeah. They're, um, they're, here's the they're house, but it, it goes all the way down there. I see. We even have bees. What are these Show them my farm. Your farm sucks ass. Whoa. You need to expand it. Oh, okay. I'm sure the, yeah, we need more farm space, but yeah, he has a farm over here. Yeah, I got a axe to cut down a tree in one hit. What is regrowth? Well, not one hit, multiple like, hits. Yeah, one block. Like what is regrowth? Uh, it, <laughs> regrowth is a Minecraft mod pack about um you basically you start and the world is completely barren. Um, there's no there's no veggies or anything. There's no uh friendly mobs. It was all um, of this. When we all, first you gotta, like that. all you got it. All you get it. You get crack sand. You get dead trees and you get water. And then you had to build up from there. You got a lot of stuff from like just that though, <laughs> like. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's magic and there's there's technology and there's all kinds of stuff. Mostly magic. It, there's also me and Drake going to sleep real quick so you can see more. <laughs> I think it's fine. I think we're done with this garbage. <laughs> I think this I garbage. Think we're this our, 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 ne our nether portal yeah, down there. That's a lot of stuff in the world. All right. Yeah, He's like, okay. we're done with this garbage. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, on to something we can all talk about here. Uh, let's see. So, how about we talk a little bit about this? About? Uh, well, talk about our summer plans. Uh, I will be working. I'll be working. Okay, fun time. Your adult plays. Okay. <laughs> yes. Anything we, else? Yeah. Like, I mean. Uh, I'll uh, be working. You got just. I have to I'll, be waiting every, I'll be waiting every two weeks for a paycheck. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Basically. Like no so I get mine every week because I, like cause I have. Like, I get my paycheck job. every Friday. No, oh, I I have two. Yeah, because you work at Kroger and they do. Oh, no, they're paycheck. gonna find um, his location now. You give us away your home address. <laughs> no, I mean my I work two I work two jobs, so I get alternating paycheck weeks. So I get one paycheck week. Oh, that's nice. That's really cool. Also, oh, one of our chickens got out. Random call. Yeah, his name's Daniel. Daniel. We don't talk about him. We don't talk. Daniel's Daniel's our uh, our uh, slave. Apparently, our Voldemort or something. Uh, like Daniel Radcliffe. <laughs> yeah, sure. Daniel Radcliffe. Yep. In the world. So uh, yeah, Cody, you got any plans? <laughs> Going to Texas Roadhouse. <laughs> yeah, to my is, birthday. That like, is that a summer plan? <laughs> I think it's more like a, oh, like a weekly plan. Like I wasn't paying attention. All summer. <laughs> summer <laughs> plan. I wasn't paying attention, so. What in the world? Uh, yeah, play yeah. some Hearts of Iron 4. Hearts of Iron 4. You do that anyways. <laughs> That's a good plan. What in the world? Well, Chalks, you came out of school recently. <laughs> what do you plan to do for the summer? Absolutely fucking nothing. <laughs> yeah. Man. I don't worry. I'll have to get a job soon enough. No, I am, I'm going to get a job eventually. Yeah. Eventually. Once I start waking up r b before uh, 3 p.m. Yeah. <laughs> and, I mean, for me, I'm thinking about, like, uploading more to my own channel, you know? I got that JRPG thing I was doing, which probably going to be short-lived. Because <laughs> the game's not that good. <laughs> but, hey, okay, you know? Yeah, it's... <laughs> Uh, probably stream a little bit more too. I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably do more streaming. Come down to it. Um, I just gotta get um, 
Audacity work or not Audacity, uh, uh, OBS working again since my oh. forced upgrade to Windows 10. Yeah. Uh, did you that get was, like that the? Was... Oh shit. Maybe you should get like OBS Studio instead. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. It's better anyways, especially for streaming. But anyways, okay. I've so far avoided the Windows 10 update. No, I woke up one morning and said, "Congratulations, you updated Windows 10." I'm like, "What?" You can downgrade. I was I was doing a download. I was downloading something, and now I have Windows 10. I wasn't downloading Windows 10. I was downloading a program. Well, you could have downgraded like immediately afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> Meh. Meh. Okay. Well, sure. All right. Let's go. That's all I got. Stuff. Stuff. Yeah. Well, let's yeah. see. Hey, uh, Jake, come here. All right. Let's give. Uh some light about this first plane slash airport Ultrox is talking about. Okay. Oh, hey, wait a minute. I'm sorry. I'm going to completely screw you over on your chance to talk. Uh, okay. Twisted, I want to hear more about some of your stories I got going on here. Cause like, during, Those have been on there forever. Like During some of your streams, like I added those because like, you were talking about them. I want to okay. know what this dude chugging lava lamp story is and this hopeless amount of spiders during a and d game you played before. Either one you uh, want to okay. do. I mean, the the okay. I'll do the. Uh, I think dude chugging a lava lamp one first. I guess that okay. one was more is more interesting. How was the, the funeral? Um, <laughs> he didn't die. Okay. Surprisingly. Okay. I would. That's uh, yeah. pretty impressive. That's pretty surprising. Pretty... I mean, yeah. Um, he also. I don't think he chugged it while it was hot. I think he just chugged the liquids out. Ugh. Ew. Still, but basically well. he had to get uh drink a <laughs> drink something that basically like basically flushes the system of w any waxy substance. Mm -hmm. We don't also know this uh, will cause extreme uh, stomach issue because apparently it also considers your stomach part of your stomach lining. Basically, they had to decide whether they want the wax inside them or a stomach lining. Yeah, and one will kill him, one will cause him to come for a long time, and then slowly kill him. What in the world? <laughs> How do you make such a um, difficult choice? This is a sad story. This is a sad story. <laughs> um, but he's fine now. Uh, he's actually, I think he finished law school. Oh, wow. That, okay. <laughs> I tell you what to represent you. <laughs> what? Seriously? He just finished law school. This is like back in high school. Oh, happened. I have, Party days are over. I have faith in my future now. If that, I can oh, no, no, no. I got a story for you. Uh, okay. I got a story you want to hear. Sure. Um, oh, God. Okay, so my uncle is a uh, foster a foster father for uh, yeah. for the Chick Fil A homes. All right. Okay. He is he is that uh, this foster home, but it's that it's um he's a deacon of a church, he's a pillar of their community. He's just basically this all around great great guy. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you the, let me tell you the roots of how where this guy came from. Okay. Have, did I tell you all the cat swinging story yet? Cat swing. I. Don't. Uh, I'm guessing no. So. Okay, so okay. my story. My dad tells a story of um, <laughs> of him coming out of the garage, and to, to the right of the garage, he had this big field. All right. Okay. And as and... he's walking out of the garage, he hears meow, 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 <laughs> and he's like, "The hell is that noise?" So he walks around the corner, and he sees this guy, the, the 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 deacon, the foster father, has a cat stringed to a rope by his feet, like hog tied by its feet, and just swinging it. What? And the meow he's hearing is him coming by the apex of the garage. Just meow, meow. And he let him go. He let, just released the rope. And the cat would get up, start gathering his shit again. And by the time the cat gathered his shit again, he would tie him back up and do it again. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> this guy has foster kids. What? I'm not even sure what happened. An asshole. He was a, basically, he was a hell of a kid. He, he said he started a forest fire when he was a kid. He... I mean, just an absolute monster from what I've heard. Is this your dad or someone he knows? This is the youngest brother of the f five kids. Okay. My parent, my grandparents didn't know how to wrap it up, I guess. What in the world? Oh, God! Oh, God! I'm going to play Minecraft, though. <laughs> okay. He so, fucked uh, me! Gregor was, fucked me! That was weird. All right. Back to all the tracks about his story. <laughs> okay. Oh, great. Okay. How am I supposed to follow that up? <laughs> I think anything's better than that right there, so I think you're okay. 
Okay, I gotta oh, go now. Catch by the feet. Okay, well, Cody's gotta go. Bye, Cody. Bye. Uh, uh, fly, so let's just keep going. Drink for. <laughs> All right. Uh, I was on a plane for the first time in the air. Yeah. Like a week ago. Mm-hmm. Not a week ago. So I rode on a plane for the first time, and uh, the okay. day before, I <laughs> went and uh, picked up my ID yeah. from like a DMV or something, mm -hmm. and uh, they gave me a paper one, and uh, so passport. I didn't need. A, I was just traveling across the state. I don't need a passport. Oh, okay. But uh, I was going to nightclub's graduation actually. Yeah. Was that so. good? What was that like? He graduated. I mean, hey, that's about as good as it can only be, I guess. <laughs> like went to a couple of uh, parties with a bunch of people I didn't know. So that's always good. Yeah. Don't you just love that? Talk to the pet. That's there. Hopefully. What? <laughs> Nothing in the world, but... Let's see. So, uh, yeah. But, uh... So I was going through to the airport, and I was really nervous. Because I was just hoping it would go well. I was actually afraid of flying, though. Like, oh, really? Anyone. It doesn't sound that scary to me. In fact, it wasn't scary when I got on the plane. I thought it was very, uh... I had, like, a existential, like... Experience or something. That's what I <laughs> like, I've been That's flying it. before, like a long time ago. Like I always wanted to fly again because it was kind of cool. Yeah, and I used to fly back and forth from the island I used to live on. The, what what? the, the island you used to live on? I used to live on an island. I told y'all that shit before. <laughs> what? Did you? <laughs> he lived on S in Samoa. <laughs> I lived on Saint Croix, the U.S. Virgin Islands. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know that. Three years of my life in my entire life. Like when, when? When did you live there? I had no. Uh, I, I moved back. I think in 07? What? In a the while world? ago. Yeah. That's, I never knew this. Why did you move there? Um, they had the second largest oil refinery in the world there, and my dad was the safety manager of it all. Oh. So I moved there. I lit. I went to private schools because the other ones you get stabbed at. And... Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, Virgin Islands is you know. a bad place to go, I guess. Oh, no, no, no. It's actually, well, that's probably worse now that the I mean, war finally shut down. I mean, what else would you go to a school for, you know? Stabbing's the number one. Number one technique, you know? Uh, um, I know the private schools I went to, they didn't have cafeterias. None of them had cafeterias at all. So rigid. What you'd have to do is, that, like, every week there's, like, Domino's Pizza Day or <laughs> McDonald's Day. Basically, your parents wow. brought a, uh, oh. gave you money to, money to go, uh... To the buy it, and they that. buy something. Awesome. <laughs> wow. No, we had, the parents had to buy it. Not only did they pay twelve hundred dollars a year to go to this damn school, they had to pay yeah. for lunches. What in the world? Wow. Just so you wouldn't get stabbed. I mean, come on, it's worth the yeah. risk. It's like life it's insurance, models. and then there's you know private school. Whichever one you know is cheaper. Um, the other one, I was the only white kid there. <laughs> well. And that that actually means I was I was actually alienated a lot. Mm-hmm. Oh, Basically, like, what are you doing there, white kids? I don't want to get out of here, white kid. What are you talking about? You're white. There's no racism against white people. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. You can shut the fuck up right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, you, got, like, you got the fire inside him going. I lost one of my best friends because of racism. What? What'd you say? Oh. <laughs> He's chugging <laughs> a lava lamp. <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> How about you put that? Um, well, I mean, no. It's to <laughs> Essentially, uh, um, this father this is actually here in the states, not there. Yeah. Um, the father didn't want me hang him hanging out with white kids, and basically said that they're not our kind. Don't hang out with them. Don't come back to my house. Yeah. What in the world? Um, still doesn't live. I stand. He just basically from that day on forward would not talk to me because it's what his dad told him. Wow. Well, good, good guy. That I mean, kid's a racist now. That kid's what he probably Donald is. Trump. He probably is. I haven't talked to him in eight years at least. Eight years in the world. Wow. What a story. Um. 
God, if you, if you want stories, I probably got tons of them I can pull out of my Man, ass. Given my like, ass. so many stories this whole time. Let's move on though to the Dread Course Demon Door. Just a quick thing, I want to mention. Oh. We talked about this before. <laughs> oh, the fucking Demon Door. <laughs> yeah, like either he's a giant or it's just the you know, it's just a Demon Door for like you know the demons to come out. Yeah, yeah. No, earlier, uh, Twisted got a message. Oh, fuck you! Yeah. Oh God! Hey, what? He stepped away, okay? He stepped away from his, from his mic, and I just heard... <laughs> what? I'm like, Dreadcore? Dreadcore? And nothing. Just... <laughs> and then like five minutes later, it came, it stopped for like a minute. I was like, okay, I guess it's over. And then he came back, hey, I heard the door open, him come back in. I was like, oh, hey, what'd I miss? Demons! You missed the demons! <laughs> what? What in the world? Just... That door is nothing but trouble. I'm telling you, Dreadcore. We there was no webcam on at that time, so I couldn't see his fucking face or what was going on in that, that dank-ass room of his with that fucked-up door. <laughs> what in the world? Demon Door's <laughs> best door. Demon Door's, <laughs> Demon door's best door. <laughs> <laughs> what is this 3DS? <laughs> like, okay, what is this 3DS plane store? Yeah, go here too. I assume it's like the same thing, kind of. I didn't finish. I didn't get to the good part of my actual plane story. Oh, is wow. that on both trips going to nightclub's house and coming back, I got a TSA pat down. Oh, That's really? Ooh, sexy. Why? Do they like suspect? Because I had anything? paper ID, and they don't like paper ID oh, apparently. Okay. So. Oh yeah, no, I need dumbass. <laughs> so, uh, luckily they were pretty nice, but. It's still a bit uncomfortable, especially if you've never flown before. <laughs> yeah, I would assume so. Like, I make my eyes extra round whenever I go on TSA airports. The best part is he's like, the guy, and like uh, when I was going back, like like explained what he was gonna do in such detail. He's like, <laughs> oh God! <laughs> I'm gonna rub my. He's like, I'm gonna take the back of my palms and rub them against your buttocks. <laughs> is that okay? Did he ask for permission or everything he did? Because the one time I've been pat down, that he asked for permission, I'm like, so I started making him feel uncomfortable. I was like, oh yeah, go on. <laughs> oh no, it's what's the one. literally the pat down becomes like that. They, they get done so Monday. fast and start getting really into it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's get it moving along, moving along. That plane ain't worth it. Go along. <laughs> okay. Okay. No, plainful passage oh. isn't worth isn't worth this harassment. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, what in the world? And also, I was wearing my Deadpool shirt when I was going. Uh, over on the first time and like five different people and most of them like four of them were tsa agents called me wade or something oh. you know oh they get, get the reference <laughs> do you get the reference that like if i wore that like a couple years ago no one would know <laughs> nobody would was. know probably yeah no one like, no one yeah i definitely would have known like <laughs> and also there's i wish i could tell this story but it involves my real name so oh. i can't do it I can bleep it out. Think of a name. Call yourself John oh, Doe or we'll something. See. Yeah. Make no, the life. joke involves my real name. So. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's the problem. Oh, man. You can just type it to us and not say it. I mean, you could, but... <laughs> so nobody would get the joke. Yeah. I don't care if they got it. <clears throat> oh, God. That, that would... If you told us, that would piss Cody off so bad. Man. We gotta make sure Cody can't know. Oh. Oh, it's gonna go on. I'll there. just type that in just for another day. Wow. Name but, reveal coming and, up soon, Mark Calendars. Okay. Now my uh, 3DS story. I was I was on the plane. I was a bit nervous. We were above the clouds, so I couldn't see anything. It, was, it wasn't very interesting. Mm -hmm. But, uh... So I pulled out my 3DS and loaded up Ghost Recon, which I had downloaded oh, on there. Oh, why? But, uh... Okay, no, so... No, why would you pull that game up out of every game? I, because, I don't know, I'm kind of addicted to it. Oh, but I loaded it up, and the, the the one level that I loaded on, that I just so happened to be on, and I didn't, like, think of, I didn't know this at all, but it was a level where you had to go into an airport and shoot up a bunch of people. What in the world? Oh. That just so happened to be the level that I was playing on the plane. Oh, so I just... no! <laughs> what? So I quit out of it and opened Pokemon instead. <laughs> good, good. What in good. the world? Maybe a little uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah. Was there anyone like, did anyone see you playing that? 
<laughs> no, I quit out of it pretty fast. <laughs> You're like, airport over, no. <laughs> Man. God, we can talk about tragedy if you want to talk about something sad. Uh, sure. What? Okay. Did you hear about all the gays dying? Okay, let's, oh, let's, let's no, see here. No, we got, no, uh... No. <laughs> <laughs> we got some other stuff here. We got... <laughs> I, I was trying to think of some way I could put that. It's just the worst way I could put it. Well, I think you did pretty good at it. Hey. Pretty good. Are, are you, you sad about the gays dying? Watch my Jessica Jones tribute. God. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> in the world. All right. <sighs> Anyways, let's get going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Sure. Okay. Keep her going. <laughs> so, uh... <coughs> How about we talk a little bit about the GTA update? You've been playing that much? Well, anyway, anyone else been playing that besides me and Ultrox? Nope. Do you remember in, the, like, the last podcast, I, like, inhaled a bag of peaches? I think I still have a cough from that. Really? I think you might have one. <laughs> it's very watch that chronic. one again. I don't remember you inhaling a bag of peaches. I think I remember something about that, yeah. It might have been, like, <coughs> between <coughs> transitions. But I think so. Maybe. No. <coughs> oh, fuck. Okay. He's dying. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Twisted and Dreadcore played the GTA update. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's talk about nope. that another time then. Uh, okay. How about we talk about <laughs> this, uh, D&D game that we've been playing a little bit. Um, I wouldn't talk about it. Okay, what the fuck is playing? <laughs> <laughs> the reason why I say that is I'm actually, I actually restarting the world. Oh. I'm only doing that for the very fact that y'all want more action. So is everything that we did that one time like, completely not happening no more? That's the what if universe. Yep, that's the what if universe now. What if nothing happened? <laughs> the one, the other one I, I have is from an, it's an old campaign I have already fleshed out pretty well. Um, but it uh, a lot more action packed. Okay. Like, we spent so Sounds long fun. though working on that. And we get to keep our characters? Yeah, you can still keep characters. Oh, they, they transfer god. over very well. Oh my god. I would they have transfer over. Character. Don't worry. I wouldn't do that to y'all if it didn't transfer over. God. Making characters, like, as a group with, like, me, Cody, and Primus, who never really played much before, was probably the <laughs> m worst experience. <laughs> Look, what I'm going to do is it's actually set up for 3.5, but instead of y'all changing it, to uh, changing all to 3.5, I'm just gonna change the whole campaign to 5 E's. So I don't have to worry about getting y'all back up to speed. I'm gonna rewrite the whole the mechanics of a whole campaign, so I don't have to go through that crap again. You mean to tell me I spent six hours rendering that two-hour video for nothing? <laughs> yeah. Well, no, you know it entertains people, and then they um. Where's the and next one you. at? Oh. <laughs> well, uh, I guess I'll make a highlight. I don't know. <laughs> Let's well, see. Hang on. That's pretty good. You're only going to disappoint. I, I, no matter, no matter what you say, this is not going to, this is not going to make him happy because if you say a low number of people, then obviously that's, that's not good. <laughs> but if you say a high number of people, then he's disappointing a bunch of people. There's there's no good there's no there's good no answer here. here. There's no winning here. I'm gonna cry. Hang on. Uh, let's see. Okay. <laughs> well. Oh God. Uh, rest in peace. GG. Uh, Todd, the flamboyant guard. <laughs> no, 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 I'll try to work Todd back in this. Oh like wow, Todd. you're gonna get Todd back in here. I'm gonna try to work Todd back into Man, this. this for context, game back. Uh, we were playing. Uh, we made a flamboyant guard. Who was attracted to Dreadcore, a uh, reptile kind of character, a dragon like character. And, uh, like, <laughs> well, it just kind of went <laughs> from there. <laughs> yeah, he just Todd became a thing. Guard. Yeah. It was good, though. He's more of a Todd. It's more of a Todd. <laughs> more of a Todd than a Twisted's dad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey. Isn't that someone's name, actually? <laughs> No, I, I, Todd came from me telling oh, the story yeah, about right, my yeah. dad booning was... his buddy Todd. Yeah. The mullet. <laughs> the mullet. With the mullet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's mullet. where Todd... That's you don't where remember Todd? <laughs> There's a podcast named after Todd. No, no, I've, I've showed dad. I've showed my dad that he's like... 
Hunter, why did you do that? I said because it's a funny <laughs> ass story. <laughs> and I called Todd up and said, "Todd, your dirty secret that he said." And first thing he said was, okay. "Not the one about you, me, and your dad, is it?" It is. God damn it! <laughs> oh man. Ugh. Well, you're not gonna be telling like any other stories because they're not gonna tell you anything no more. <laughs> they're not gonna tell me shit. You should have like like a list of like stuff like, "Oh yeah, you guys do anything crazy?" And then you're just like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." <laughs> This is good stuff. I'm set for life. Okay. Well. How about... We're about... What is it? About 30 minutes in, give or take. Let's go yeah. ahead and... Uh, do a little bit of... Uh, the last bit we end the podcast with. Which, Judge Court, do you have to go now? No. Okay. When do you leave? Three or four. When do you, uh, when do you leave the podcast? I have to leave by 3.30. 3.30. It's currently 3.06. That was a 40-minute drive from your work, from your house to your work. Okay. Oh, we, we yeah. have pumpkins. Anyways. Yeah, I know we have pumpkins. All right. So how, you, started, you started like 4.30 or something. You start work. I started at 5. Oh, okay. See, it's time. Never mind. Right. So I, need, I, need to, I, I need to leave at 4. It's hey, Dreadcore, when's the next top koala? Yeah, hey, that's a good question. When is it? You got uh, two people to pick from. That's still a thing. What is it? Yeah. Jake and Jake and Cody? Jake I think and Cody. I can pick from. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Not um, now, but you gotta pick eventually. Call him out. Call him out. Yeah. Challenge Dude, Jake's only been in for LLS one LLS session. Ice challenge. No, Jake's been in multiple sessions. You kidding me? He's been at I've least been two podcasts. Multiple. He's been on multiple podcasts. Yeah. Ugh. Busy playing Counter Strike. <laughs> he might actually be playing Counter Strike now. Let me see. <laughs> oh no, he's playing GTA. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I don't think they got, I think they got friended him. Probably not. I don't think a lot of like. Did you guys like add Zarthos whenever he was in here? Yeah, I, I did. Have, I have never even met the Zarthos. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Case in point, I guess. All right, so uh, how are we gonna end this? Right, we're doing uh, Would You Rather now. Would you rather have no tongue or have no teeth? Um. Oh, that's a hard one. Jeez. Um, Man. Uh, okay, here's what it no says. No teeth. No, you cannot get dentures. They will oh, be forcibly fuck. removed. You will just I never get dentures. I, I'd rather have to begin with. I'd rather have no teeth because you can still talk with no teeth. It's a little harder Therapy. to talk with no tongue. I mean, I, they're both yeah, pretty much used for like, talking. Yeah, I can I can still make some kind of uh, kind of like dingo dish, you know. Nice I can try. Try. I can get the gist across with no with no with no teeth. I mean, I guess you could. Let's all try to do it for now, like just momentarily. Like, the neighbor. <laughs> all right, just. I'm not back in infinity. If I could be, 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 be. <laughs> first in the world, which is weird. Am I not Okay. Yeah, somebody bobbed it. 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 Somebody Oh, yes, that's sense. about right. I can, I, I can see that. Here's some comments. This guy votes for no teeth. Both would cause you to have speech problems, but I think teeth would be easier to manage. Yeah. Well. Plus, you'd be able to chew. Mm. Chewing is nice. Yeah. I, I, I enjoy meat. People are, like, <sighs> trying to get technical in this. No, you can have teeth replacements, not dentures. In the world. Okay, let's move on. Let's see. Next question here is going to be... <laughs> this is a Harry Potter question. I'm not gonna do that. Oh one fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather have your blood sucked by a vampire or have your brain eaten by a zombie? Which I think is, I would rather have my blood sucked. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. Why would I want to be <laughs> dead? <laughs> Live through that. Eighty-eight percent agree. <laughs> what a surprise! <laughs> what? <laughs> what a stupid question. <laughs> would you rather be a vampire or die? <laughs> yeah. What in the world? All right, here we go. Would you rather be a character on Lost or be a character on Heroes? 
Why would I want to be on Lost? Like, everyone died, I think, right? Doesn't the world end in Heroes as I well? mean, they, they rebooted it. I'm, I don't know how that ended. <laughs> yeah, being the reboot of Heroes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It, it's kind of like a reboot. I mean, you know, they're continuing it, kind of. I don't know if they'd be on Heroes. It would Heroes. just suck to not be one of the main characters in Lost, because then you're fucked. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be like, like a side character, like somewhere out in, like, you know... You die in the plane crash. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Oh, man. Also, I'm on a documentary and the yeah, plane just got me. Too. Anyways. Save the cheerleader, save the world. <laughs> exactly. Alright. A lot of people want to be on Heroes. 73% say Heroes. Uh. Yeah. Man. Oh, it's an obvious choice from the comments. Uh, okay. Would you rather. Live in a penthouse in the city or live in a mansion in the country? Oh, isn't that nice? <laughs> um, mansion. Just, I don't care if it's in the ghetto. Give me a mansion. It says you would have the same amount of money in either case. So, I would oh, be broke oh. in a week. Yeah, this property <laughs> no, taxes. Like, mm -hmm. like, not that you have the money you have now, but you just have the same amount of money if it's, like, really high. You got the same amount of really high money if the other choice. Uh, I mean, I I don't. Don't quite understand the question. I mean, I don't like either of those choices really, because I don't want to have that a big house that big, and I I don't really want a cottage because that. Uh, it's I, not the no, question. No, 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 mansion, mansion. <laughs> what? I'm gonna go with a penthouse, like yeah. GTA. I can be yeah. in GTA. I'm gonna go with my own, own island. island. My own organization. Oh, I'm gonna just... be seized by the FBI. It's gonna be great. Ten car garage. Ten car Twist... garage. <laughs> Twisted chose the the, the uh, third the third option. The third option. <laughs> yeah. The island. The final island. solution. Hold on. I'm gonna take the island. Racism. I don't. From know. Lost. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Forty three percent say live in a penthouse in the city. I'm in the minority. Mm, yeah. I'm used to it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so I'm white. Shocks. Or so it's twisted. I mean. <laughs> Let's see. Alright. Uh, okay, this is interesting. Would you rather never touch a computer again, or never touch a person of the opposite sex again? <laughs> oh, God. Fucking damn it. Oh, man. Wait, 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 wait. It says never touch a computer again. Jesus um, Christ. Don't be technical like what this. If, what if it's touching a computer the of the opposite sex? <laughs> <laughs> Computers don't have sex. That's they it. will one day. <laughs> they will one day. Man, we all gotta be gay. One day. It's the only way. Let's see. Um, um God. Uh, I don't... What the... <laughs> oh, wow. The answer may surprise you. Maybe not. Who knows? What? Uh, I mean, have you guys, like, decided? Oh, uh... No, I can't decide. I can't... I mean, no, I can't so decide this question? one. question? I Would you rather answer. never touch a computer again, or never touch a person of the opposite sex again? Never touch at all? Never touch at like, all. Like, uh, job interview is going to be interesting. <laughs> uh, yes. Thank you. Like, I, if I if I'd okay. never, like, had sex again, that'd be okay. I'd live no. with that. <laughs> but, like, n never touch at all. Yeah, no, you can't touch them at all. No. No hands. Can't shake their hands. No, no, no. Not even accidentally bumping into someone. Oh, no. It's like a shield. Dude, like, hold on, hold on. If you, had a you, like, if you just add the bunch of women lay on the ground, just lay on the ground, could you essentially hover? Wait a minute. What if, like, someone was, like, a big enough <laughs> hoo ha, and, like, you just. It's like, kind of oh, like that one no. game, you know, where, like, you got, like, the surgeon, and, like, you got, like... Yeah. <laughs> deadly not touching. Touch <laughs> yeah. Like, Operation, man. I, I can't <laughs> touch. Operation, that's what it is. What if it's like that? That'd be great, right? <laughs> what if What if you touch them with a 10-foot pole? Is that still considered touching? No. <laughs> Wait, what? But what if you have a condom on? I mean, is that considered touching? I mean, you gotta be you, careful. Have to, you gotta have like plates you, around because like what if you, have a whole, yeah, you have like to a like whole... you have to like wear a, 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 a entire condom suit. It's like, yeah, it's like, 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 <laughs> it's, like you, it's like you do it and like it just goes to your feet. Oh dang! <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go with computer then. Okay. Wait, no, re no, never I touch a woman. I would That's get a divorce if I, I picked the other one. What in the world? Well. Uh, 78% saying never touch a computer again. Wow. 
Yeah. I personally said not touch a person again. <laughs> I can't make that decision. I really can't make that decision. I don't have enough. I don't have enough information. <laughs> well, Drudge Cry hasn't given up hope yet. He still thinks he's got a chance. <laughs> Say I'm rooting oh, for the condoms. Given up. Yeah, that yeah. means you've given up, like, oh god. Uh, uh, oh, okay. I actually quite like the idea of an entire condom suit. I'm gonna invent it. <laughs> wow, we need to get this, like, patented before, like, we publish this. Okay. That's a dumb question. Anybody got a couple thousand YouTube dollars? <laughs> I got ten YouTube bucks. Making that YouTube money. Oh shit, you told us you have broken your terms of agreement. Contract. Oh no. Oh fuck. This is Maker Studio is gonna come after me. <laughs> yeah. This is an interesting one. It says, would you rather be Nancat or have the ability to make any rage face of your choice? Which me do you want to be? Yeah, Wait, can I use the Nancat to like get out of situations like, it's like, oh no, you killed my daughter. Oh shit. Would you would you either be Nancat? Yeah, you would you be Nyan Cat. Oh, yeah. Wait. No, 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 that'd be a terrible idea. Because yeah. then you're just Nyan Cat. There's, it's, yeah. I'd rather be able to make any rage face, because I can just not make rage faces. I think that's true. I think that's true. I would like this ability as well. Uh, wow. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Huh. A lot of people want to make rage faces. 70% say uh, rage face. Wow. Fucking weebs. That's I'm going to be Nyan Cat just to go against the groove. You know? Yeah, huh. I am too. Sure, I'll have to live my entire life as Neon Cat. But... <laughs> I, know, I thought it was something you can just like transform and like a uh, wheel. You, B. You're, I'll you, be the living are, meme. You <laughs> are Neon Cat. Man. Also includes the music, by the way, said in there. Uh, so, new question here. Would you rather be blind or be dumb? <laughs> um, I assume they mean a certain type of dumb, but I'm just going to say so. dumb. I don't know. I, I, I would rather... Oh, hey, wait, wait. Uh, dumb mean, refers mute. to the inability to speak. Yes. Why did oh, you just say okay. mute? I don't... Dumb is kind of an offensive way to say mute. Yeah. Like, I, I would like old... I, I would rather be mute. I'd yeah. rather be I'd mute. I'd rather yeah. be mute. That way, I can never be on YouTube ever again. <laughs> no, no. You, know, you, know, you make like, a face channel called... called. The mute, the mute YouTuber, and all, basically all you do is you sign gamer the entire time you play, <laughs> like one hand on there, you know, it's like oh yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, all right. Well, let's see here. Oh, okay. Well, thirty-eight percent say be blind. Okay. Well, most of them say mute though. So yeah. So oh, we can't really trust their answer, anyways. This is you a trust dumb anyone. question. Uh, I'm not gonna read that one. Screw it. Uh, You'd never be able to play Would You Rather if you were blind. Uh, there's, read... there's there's text to speech. This is a nice one. Uh, would you rather never understand the concept of time or never understand the concept of sex? <laughs> yeah. um... What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> never. I would rather not uh, never understand the concept of sex because the concept of time that would be kind of. All right, let me bad. read the description here. You, you you would you would go and like do something and then you would just starve to death because you wouldn't you wouldn't realize time. At I time. don't understand either right. already. Here's what it says: huh. uh, meaning you will not be able to tell time or anything related to time, and never understand anything involving sex. Yeah. See, so you, you would like you'd go off and like. I don't know, read a book or or go to the restroom or something. You come out of the restroom and be like fucking like 10 hours later and you'd be like, what? Oh. But just because you don't understand time doesn't mean you would yeah. spend 10 hours in a bathroom. Yeah. Like... There's like, okay, you got to be there at 412. I be there at what? Huh? Huh? In 20 minutes. What? I have to be at the Lazy Koala's podcast at two. I better go off and do other things. <laughs> All right, hey, no, I was, I was, <laughs> I was helping people being a good Samaritan. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, let's see. Man, okay, let's see what people say. But then um, I would never be able to attend the Lazy Koala's podcast if I didn't know about sex at all. That's, that's half my jokes. It's true. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see. Seventy-one percent say never understand the concept of time. Really? Seventy-one. That's a lot. It's That's that's really a that whole important. lot, actually. Oh. I'm kind of kind of concerned about that. Okay. 
Oh, hey, this is a classic one. Would you rather get one million dollars or find true love? Um, I I am true. legally obligated to say true love. Listen, yeah. she's in there. It's fine. You're okay. We don't have to share this to her. It's fine. I I I money. I, fucking money, 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 yeah. money. Jesus money. fucking Christ! I could really money. use that money. I could really use that <laughs> I, money. I would say true love. I would say true. Oh, oh isn't like that? He's really hasn't lost hope yet. He really thinks he still has a chance with someone. Fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. Fuck you. Uh, let's see. Oh, this, is, this is a much closer one. 59% uh, say find true love. What a bunch of fucking liars. <laughs> <Yeah>. Like, <laughs> oh, honey, I would totally. Like, some Money, you, get, you get to marry a bitch. Plus Ooh. Obvious. I can buy a lot of alcohol with that money. You spend your entire lifetime as Donald Trump just marrying whoever you want and then divorcing them, you know? A million dollars is isn't been faithful? that... Oh, quote unquote. I don't really know. No. You can tell they're definitely not in love, though. They they have. He's, he has definitely uh, had an affair with. Yeah, most think, definitely. Okay. No. Um, uh, no, if he said his first wife and then he had an affair, I think that's what broke up the marriage. So. Who, who's, uh, whose daughter is the. Uh, I just smelled a fart girl. What? I have no idea. What? Literally, the daughter you keep ta- seeing people talk about, she lets she just smell like the worst fart. She's like. Ivanka Trump. <laughs> oh no, so that's, that's her fucking face. I've. I had no idea. Everyone on MySpace oh, yeah. in 2008. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, let's move on here. Uh, which rather suck a hobo's toe for two minutes or be in a cage with honey badger and a lion for 20 seconds? One de- One's death. One's death. Yeah, one um, you're gonna die. How how day. how big is the cage? Uh, it doesn't say. Could I climb on to the to the roof? Let's well, just of say the a cave. ten by ten uh, enclosed uh, battle like of the death. D and D game <laughs> is talking yeah. about I mean, I mean, if the if the lion's just lying there, it's not necessarily like lion, angry at you. You can just there. sit there. You so you can just sit there and like not move for twenty seconds, and it won't attack you. It's not like lions automatically. Honey badgers are angry you. though. Honey badgers. Yeah, honey badgers just fuck you up, then ask questions later. True. Like, should Pretty I really mauled there. that guy's face off? <laughs> Eh, it's too late now. It's already happened. Man. Lawyers are writing notes to his family right now. Do you really want to risk it just so you don't have to suck a hobo's toe or whatever, Dreadcore, Core? Really? Dude, I'm not sucking a hobo's toe. I'm sorry. I think I'd rather. Maybe it's a very clean hobo, you know? Yeah, I'm going to go with the hobo one. Maybe he washes in the river. <laughs> oh. Nobody that might be even worse. Uh, I'm not sure. Very few people say homo's toe. 69% say be in a cage. <laughs> really? Yeah. People would rather die than suck a homo's toe, what's people your understanding? Like, no. This is like representing Maybe what you'd society. make that no, hobo I, dead. I won't necessarily no. die. They, oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, is there a honey badger? Oh, there? God. <laughs> <laughs> Did someone, like, release a honey badger in a lion in your home? No, I accidentally hit a uh, zombie pig man. Oh, okay. Well, let's see. Oh, okay. Uh, no, I'm not gonna read that one. <laughs> I'd show that hobo a good time. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is a this is a, one of those questions where people probably lie a lot. Would you rather launch an atomic bomb or be bombed with an atomic bomb? <laughs> or be what? Be what with an atomic bomb? Be launch it. An atomic launch bomb. it into the ocean. Like, would you I'd rather watch, watch it or be killed by it? I would definitely uh, rather, rather. Like, do you want to be responsible for I'd killing rather... people or not? No, I don't. Yes. I'm, I'm not going to kill people. I'm going I'm to fucking I'll launch it in the middle of the ocean. Kidding me? I'll, yeah, I'll fucking it, launch it. It doesn't say where. There's no. Doesn't say where. That's what people say in the comments too. Doesn't say Basically, where. Basically, here. I can launch here, it. Here, be in the ocean. middle. No, be the one. Hold on. Be the one dropping the bomb in Hiroshima. The one looking up at the bomb, going, "What the hell is that?" Also, I'm in Seattle, so I'm gonna kill millions of people <laughs> if I drop an atomic bomb on myself. That's true. What if I'm on vacation, though? I'm oh. on vacation. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna kill everyone there, too. <laughs> so, uh, surprisingly, actually, this is not at all what I expected. I thought more people would lie. 83% said launch an atomic bomb. <laughs> no, I would definitely launch an atomic bomb. I think bomb. The people in the comments might have swayed their opinion. I launch a, can I launch multiple atomic bombs? <laughs> Yeah, is there an amount I can launch? Is there is there a number, like a minimum number? Can I make I Fallout 4 a reality? Oh, no. <laughs> can I make this land Fallout 4? Because I will. Don't, I will. Please, please don't end the world. 
right, let's do a few more here. This world needs to be wiped. Don't become Dr. Trump. Fresh slate, fresh slate, fresh slate, fresh slate. Please don't become President Nuclear Trump. Nuclear winter. <laughs> okay. Would you well, I like winter, and I like I like the idea of wiping out the races. So, yeah. You know what? Nuclear winter sounds amazing. Okay. Would you rather have to wash your hands every 10 minutes, assuming you're awake, uh, or would you rather only wash your hands once a month? Um, well, I do that one already. Okay, well, I don't want to ever shake your hands. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. No, no, no. The, the uh, wash my hands every, you know, few oh, minutes. Oh, okay. My job requires me to do that shit. Oh, yeah. Okay. What do you guys think? Uh, um, I'm gonna say once a month, but then I'm gonna pretend I'm a germaphobe and always wear gloves. I don't think it works that way. I don't oh. think I I I don't think that's a way you you know that's perfectly acceptable. I think it's not. It doesn't say you can't wear gloves in the rules. Yeah, well you don't know that. But it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Does it? No. <laughs> Do I have to wash my hands once a month, or can I skip it? I, I think, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can I skip that too much one? Shovel. Oh, dead, too I much shovel. Too much shovel. I can't. I'm too used to it now. Uh, do or do they do they uh, do they you know like is it like uh, like if I forget one month, can I do it twice the next month? How does this work? Is it like you do it on the thirty first? No wash the November. First? <laughs> yeah, can like. Can I do it like any time that month? So like I can like I assume so. I assume so. Yeah, so I, I could do twice like a really two days in a row. Day, you're like, okay, this is the day I wash my hands. And then it, like it, it gets like like postponed, and like you're like, damn. <laughs> oh well, I'll wait again. <laughs> Sir, is there any reason why you can't join us on this jury duty? I gotta wash my hands. <laughs> Listen, you don't want to know what I've been doing. Okay. Look, I, I cooked chicken for week th uh, a couple oh. weeks ago, and it's just bad. And think, think of all the diseases you would get, like, for cooking, you know? Yeah. Sir, I work at the CDC and haven't washed my hands in a month. That's why I can't, sir. <laughs> Which, by the way, the CDC is just as terrifying, if not more, than uh, the uh, Walking Dead let, let on. Yeah, it really is. Quite I've, been, I've been in there a couple times. Well, sixty-seven percent. room with a bunch of computers. <laughs> was there a guy that uh, you know was going to blow the whole thing up? Was the glass really that strong? That's a fucking spoiler. Actually, yeah, it's all, it's all one spoiler. All bull, it's all bull, <laughs> I think we can safely say we don't. I don't think we have to do spoiler warnings for the first fucking season of Walking Dead anymore. That kid died. Shane's dead. <laughs> that kid died. That kid died. <laughs> that one. Good. I say died. good. Let's, 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 we need to kill more kids. That's, that, that's going to be like secluded. That's a twisted quote, 2016. We need to kill more kids. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, 67% say so you have to wash your hands every 10 minutes. Okay. Let's do one more. I just feel like I'd be busy. Too busy <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'd be too busy. I only, have, I only have time for one more. Okay, yeah, you gotta go like, right now. Okay. Uh, would you rather be a racist or be a sexist? <laughs> Already oh, won. So um, hey, Twisty, you're good. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Which one do you, Twisty? You know, I I think these jokes are funny, but I'm not racist. I really, <laughs> really am not. I think they're funny, though. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I'm not really. I don't really hate black people. I just think they're horrible. I think they're funny to make fun of. I, I don't. I definitely don't. Do not, like, none of us hate fucking black people get over yourself i think that's what really what racism is like if, if you you can make jokes about it i think it's yeah. probably all right look the thing is though this is what i don't that's what i don't like i believe everyone in this world should be should be able to be made fun of absolutely everyone i don't care if you're crippled i don't care if you're retarded i don't care if you're black mexican chink i don't care what you are <laughs> everyone's gone through pain you know? i believe you should be allowed to be made fun of I like how he just threw in a casual racist term. <laughs> <laughs> he did. I was like, oh. Well, I'm going to say a racism just so I don't alienate half of the entire population. I want to say oh, oh, you're just, so you're just I already said the computer you're thing. So you're, just, so you're just saying this. My you're just alienating, North Dakota, like. Okay? My parents live in yeah. North Dakota. 
Okay. You want to know what an actual stereotype of the Indians are? What? Deadbeats. Every single one. That's actually true. Oh, shit. They're all, they all live on that. On the oh, that's the end of the podcast. Uh, all right, bye. And see they you. huff paint. <laughs> Literally, that's all I do is huff fucking paint the all entire right, day. This right oh, look at you. You're like some kind of badass, where, where, are you? Where'd my shield go? Where'd my shield go? Once I was like, I need to get my shield back, you fucking no. asshole! Never! No, no compromise! <laughs> GG, podcast is over. <laughs> it just ends the fucking rants. <laughs> okay, oh, that's it. We're done. Oh, that's it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I just <laughs> fucking rants. Ultrox, I'd just like to note that you said you didn't want to alienate half the population. Well, if you're saying you want to be racist, that's... That's, a, that's more than half. It's not half the population. population. I mean, it seems like... Oh, all right. All right, it's true, it's true. I was thinking everyone except your race you'd be racist against. So, yeah, you can pick just one race to be racist against. Come on. I suppose so, yeah. <laughs> well, now we got that settled. <laughs>